Good afternoon, everybody. Um, just want to jump on here and touch base with you all real quick. Um, give you some information that you need on some dates that are upcoming and also clarify some things with our weight training um, program that we're going to have coming up for the incoming freshman. Our weight training camp is what we're calling it. So first, I'll start with the dates that we have here in March. So here this month, um, March 14th is a unique opportunity. It's a, it's a something that we've been doing with the young men since we've been here, um, our coaching staff. It is a recruiting seminar, and that's March 14th at 6 p.m. in the St. Pius Main Gymnasium. Um, it's a recruiting seminar. It's something that we're putting on as coaches um, that we've developed. Coach Warmack has helped us develop it, and Coach Warmack has been our recruiting coordinator of sorts, and uh, we've put together this presentation for the young men. And in the past, it's just been the young men. This year, because we've had parents asking questions and, and some of the, the information not being relayed, we're having parents um, attend as well if they would like to attend. So it's our recruiting seminar, it's in the main gym, and it's gonna be a presentation that I will put on or uh, Coach Warmack, we both may, may tag team it, but um, it is just gonna be a, a cool, cool little event for you to learn if you're interested in playing college football in particular or college sports, it teaches you what is gonna be necessary to be recruited. It is a process. And you, if you know, you have, a, you have a, a huge advantage if you know what to expect going into that process. So um, I'd like to invite anybody that has a son that, is, uh, that wants to play college sports, um, in particular football. But if you wanna go play baseball, you come to this, it's still, it would be, it's good to learn. Baseball recruiting is different than football. So is basketball. So is wrestling. Um, they're all different. They're unique to their sports, but the overall message is the same. Um, and, and so you, everybody would be able to take something away from this. So it's something that we're offering to all of the football players. And want, I would like to invite you all. So your son, you know, we've, I would like to see, you know, definitely a, a, your son needs to be there, uh, not just a parent. You know, I think it's it's good. We're trying to teach these young men to advocate for themselves. So I think it's really important that they're there learning about the things that they need to do. OK, we as parents and as coaches can help guide them. But at the end of the day, hey, this is your responsibility as a young man to do this. So um, but this year we are inviting parents. So if you're a parent that would like to attend, you are more than welcome. I think it'd be a great thing so that you guys can see uh, what we're communicating to the boys and, and what the expectation is and, and how recruiting has changed and, and what everybody needs to be doing. So I'd like to invite you all. That is uh, once again, March 14th at 6 p.m. in the main gym. And hopefully that's gonna be right around 45 minutes to an hour, just depending on how many questions there are um, and, and all of that. So. That's how long that should take, so it shouldn't be too long. Um, something that is mandatory that we need everybody to attend, and that is our uh, annual parent meeting, and this is our spring parent meeting. Uh, we'll get together in the main gym at 6 p.m. on March 28th. Now, um, so if you can mark this on your calendar, March 28th, it's a Monday evening. Both of these are Monday evenings. March 28th at 6 p.m. at St. Pius in the main gym. Uh, we'd like everybody to attend and we need at least one parent from every family and um, and your player to be at this meeting we'll go into expectations for the summer expectations for the season expectation for players expectation for parents we'll, we'll, we will touch on just a little about a little bit of everything um, we'll introduce you to all the coaching staff we'll introduce you to our team mom for those of you that are new and uh, we'll introduce you to our Under Armour representative and, and who we will be contacting for orders and things like that. So we'll have um, everything lined up for you there. You'll get a lot of information and, uh, you know, it's just it's a it's a great night. We're doing it, trying to do it early enough to give everybody time to plan their their summer out and uh, into the fall. So those are the dates in March and that is it. But uh, one of them on the 14th. The recruiting seminar, that's an optional thing for whoever would like to attend. Uh, but on the 28th, we do need um, we, we do need a parent and player uh, available on the 28th for the parent meeting. 
Um, and just like anything else, I tell the young men when they miss, if they can't make it to a workout for some reason or a pra whatever it is, they need to communicate with me and let me know, hey, coach, I'm not going to be there because of this. And um, that's just a, a habit that we've started to create, and they're doing one heck of a job with it. Um, so I want to get into our uh, what we're calling our weight training camp, what we've called, and that is for our incoming freshmen. So all of the St. Pius incoming freshmen can attend this weight training camp, and it's awesome. It's an awesome thing. We started it last year, and it was just great. Um, all the, the young men that, that participated in it last year really had a leg up and they were prepared to hit the summer, hit the ground running in the summer. And it's just a great opportunity for these young men. So if you guys, if you're on the team app, which I hope you're all on it, if you're not, you need to reach out to either myself or Cheryl so that we can get you on the team app and get your communications going with the team. Um, but if you're on the team app in the documents portion of the team app, our calendars are in there right now. And as I have updates to the calendars, I'll update them and Cheryl will re-upload a new one. Um, but the calendars are in there right now. And if you go in there and you look at all the calendars, it spells out pretty much everything that we're doing from now until August, um, until school starts. So uh, it's a great tool to have. And you know, naturally there will be some minor changes here and there um, when things happen or when I get, a, if I get a call from another coach and, they want to schedule something with us. We may we may adjust our schedule a little bit in the summertime. But um, if you look on there and you look at the month of April and May, okay, um, the highlighted in green where it says young guns, I'm talking to you. I'm talking to right now when I say young guns, I'm talking to all the incoming freshmen, okay? Once we get into the season and once we have a varsity JV and a C team, when I say young guns, I'm talking to the C team. So. Um, that's just my terminology for those guys, young guns. Um, it's not freshman team, it's not C team, it's the young guns, it's that group. So 99.9% um, .9 of freshmen will be in the young guns group. And um, so I'm talking to you guys when I say young guns, just to be clear on that, because I know um, there's been some questions like, hey, what's this young guns group? Um, so if you look on those calendars, April and May, the highlighted in green, young guns, um, workouts from 4 to 5 15 p.m. That is you guys that is this weight training camp workouts. So uh, in order to be eligible to, to go to this weight training camp, I need everybody to sign up. So there will be a link on this video. Um, underneath this video, I'll post a link in YouTube, but Cheryl will also send it out on the team app when she sends us out. We'll have a, a sign up link to our weight training camp. Everybody has to be signed up. Um, does two things for us. Make sure um, all liabilities and everybody's covered. At number two, it also lets us know who is signed up because we've only got 32 spots available for this camp. Um, that's all we can work out at one time right now in our weight room. And then we also don't want to go above that number because we want to make sure, I mean, this is a foundational thing for these young men. I'll get, in that, get into that in a second. But uh, we want to make sure we have enough coaches' eyes on these young men to make sure that we're, we're starting them off right. So just to touch on this weight training camp for the incoming eighth graders, what this is, is it is a foundational thing for us. So we did it last year and it was, it, it was phenomenal. And so we're not, gonna, we're not gonna immediately come in here and say, hey, here's 200 pounds, throw it on your son's back and say, squat it, okay? Um, that is not what we do. So right now, uh, when they come in initially, it's just going to be all body weight stuff. It's going to be flexibility. It's going to be how do we move? Coach T is going to see how much work he needs to do to put these to get these young men body ready to do the exercises that we need them to do. Um, and so, what our goal is this spring is to to hopefully get everybody to pass our flexibility test and our core test, um, so that we know okay they can safely squat or they can safely clean. Um, we will also start doing those exercises to show them the techniques and the cues that we use to coach them and through those techniques. So that is, the, that is really the process for our, uh, our weight training camp. It, it's a foundational thing so that you know when we hit June, when we start working in June as a team, um, these freshmen 
Now they're through that part. They know how to do it. And now we can start working and we can start growing and, and we can start getting stronger. So um, naturally, sometimes there are freshmen that are a little more advanced than others. There are a lot of them. So we'll have guys that have maybe been working out for a couple of years. We'll have some guys that have never, ever seen a weight, touched a weight, which is perfectly fine. We will work with everybody on their own speed and tempo. Um, so just know that that is what this, this camp is. Um, so 32 spots available. Um, we will open it up to some seventh graders. Um, that w if we, Just assuming that we do have a few spots available in this, uh, we will open it up to some seventh graders as well. So if you have a seventh grader, if you know of a seventh grader, um, do not do not hesitate to um, get them signed up as well. So use that link, get signed up. That's the first thing I would do. Um, sign up through that link and we'll get you on there because we'll start creating a list and um, we need to know from a number standpoint, um, you know, the amount of eyeballs we need as coaches and, and um, the amount of space that we're going to need each, each and every day when we do this. So um, that information is on the calendar um, and I will get you the link to sign up. So please sign up for that link immediately. It's free. Um, we offer this for free. This is just something that's part of us developing you into a football player. So um, this is this does not cost anything. It is a, a free camp um, to get these young men ready for the summer. So looking forward to working with each and every single one of them. Looking forward to meeting every single one of you, for those of you that I haven't met, and uh, just really excited. Um, just a quick note on where we're at um, with our varsity guys. We've had, um, to this point, the best off season that that I've had since since we've been here as a coaching group and it's just been really really enjoyable we're working with a great group of young men they're working extremely hard um, we've had some great leaderships leadership leaders step up and uh, it, it's it's going to be a really enjoyable season um, super thankful to to be able to coach such a great group of young men um, and to do it with an amazing staff so um, we're deep into the off-season program, and, uh, and and these guys are doing phenomenal, and and I really can't wait to to add this this uh, incoming freshman class into the mix, and and really really start getting going here uh, over the next few months. So, really looking forward to it. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to me, or you can reach out to our team mom Cheryl Ross, and she usually knows more than I know, you know, when it comes to all this stuff. So. Um, if, if you have any questions, feel free to reach out to either one of us. We will get you taken care of. So thank you so much for your time. Looking forward to meeting you all. And hopefully I'll see quite a few of you at the recruiting uh, clinic. And then um, if not, we will see you all at the parent meeting. So thank you so much. And if you know of anybody else that may want to play football, that's going to be in this incoming freshman class that has not, that has kind of been back and forth, um, please share this with them. And I wanna get them signed up as soon as possible. And I know there's there's been a handful of people that I've spoken with that are kind of trying to decide what they want to do. Um, you know, first year football players are always more than welcome. This is, uh, you know, this is a, a process that we go through that every single young man goes through. And it doesn't matter how good you are as a freshman. Um, it, it is a process and, you know, everybody goes through that process at a different rate, but, uh, uh, so anybody, anybody and everybody is welcome to play. So share this with those that, uh, that are on the fence because they're more than welcome to come in and start working with us. So thanks again for your time. Really appreciate you all. Looking forward to meeting you.